Well, tonight, a former Willard mayor and alderman is sentenced to three years in prison for his role in wire fraud and identity theft. This man, Corey Hendrickson, was a fleet dispatcher for Prime Trucking. That's where he used employees' personal data to make hundreds of fraudulent transactions. Fox 49's Joshua Pineda is live in Willard after talking with the current mayor who's excited about the future of the city. Josh? Yeah, Mayor Troy Smith and the Board of Aldermen approved a code of ethics ordinance in hopes that it holds every elected official accountable. Following today's sentencing for Corey Hendrickson, who was given three years in prison for his crimes, Mayor Smith says the code of ethics ordinance is something that city leaders have discussed at length. It's just what the state entail or what the state stipulates is that if there's any kind of conflict of interest by, um, you know, the board of aldermen or any elected official um, with the city when it comes to business transactions and things of that nature, then those, those things be disclosed. Smith says he even wanted to take it a step further by creating their own code of ethics, which is a set of guidelines on how officials should conduct themselves. We had discussions at length about creating our own code of ethics, um, but then unfortunately in talking to our uh, legal counsel, they advised us there really was that those code of ethics at the local level really don't have much teeth and there's not a lot you can do unless somebody is doing something that's um, illegal. In light of Hendrickson's actions, Angie Wilson, a concerned citizen, is pushing for a state audit to be done on the city. And in a statement sent to Fox 49, she says, Closure on this ugly chapter in Willard history will not happen until residents are confident that they have the answers they need. A state audit will help accomplish that. Hendrickson has to be uh, has to surrender himself on September 30th before 2 p.m. to be transported to federal prison. Reporting in Willard, I'm Joshua Pineda, Fox 49 News.